next, it is a UFC welterweight championship showdown between the Nigerian nightmare Kamaru Usman and Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. So here is a pro dating to 2003. Here is the consummate veteran, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal, arguably the greatest mixed martial arts athlete the state of Florida has ever produced. Longtime staple of the American top team in Coconut Creek, Florida. He's got heart, the toughness to go with it, cardio, an outstanding jab, and a submission game to go with it. This is one of the more well-rounded welterweights in the world, and as such, he has vaulted into title contention. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion champion of the world tonight after this fight. The champion is in focus, he is in his prime, he's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. for this, our main event of the evening. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, and they both possess a similar height and reach. We go inside the octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Welterweight Championship of the World. It's fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 13 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, presenting the challenger, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. And now introducing the champion, this man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 14 wins, one loss. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting at a Boca Raton, Florida, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Kamaru. All right, this is for the championship. You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. The fighters touch him up. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, here we go. This should be good. Five rounds if needed to determine the UFC's welterweight champion. Oh, powerful right leg kick. One-two punch by Usman. These guys are going at it here right away, trading blows. And he connects there, Joe. And now Masvidal's shot there is blocked. Landing a good series of strikes here. Effective punch there by Usman. Oh, double jab. Offensive fight, nice job to block the shot there. Powerful effort. 
The jab followed by the right hand. The left hook hits home. Oh, how good is that jab? Snaps it off yet again here. Nasty leg kick land. We gotta fight, folks. Oh, what a leg kick. Oh, lands a huge kick, Joe. Big knee to the body. The left hook hits home. Vicious, vicious punch combinations here. Oh, huge block. Nice jab. And now Masvidal's cut is only getting worse here, Joe. Man, is that thing bleeding. That knee might have landed there. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. Landed that left hook. Nice knee. Usman gets the over under. Two minutes remain in the round. Double under hooks in the clinch. Oh, uppercut lands, and he leaned right into that one. Joe left the head wide open there for the taking. Let's see if now that wakes him up a little bit and he learns to get those hands up. And he connects there. Good defense there. Oh, he's getting some hip in that one. Effective use of the jab there by Gamebrook. Back and forth we go. And he lands it to the leg. Wow. Good straight hand there by Kamaru. Punch coming, it's blocked. 30 seconds to go. Usman gets caught with that punch. Oh! He hurt him. Body kick, look at He's that. He's got hurt here. Oh, he good left hand. hand there. What a wild exchange. What an end to round one. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. Second round underway. This is gonna become one of those things where you're just wondering what's, what's the opponent gonna be able to do to him. Not even whether or not he's gonna win, but what's his opponent gonna be able to do to him? Masvidal has been nearly impossible to put away by knockout in his career. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Finds his range with the jet. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Oh, nice uppercut. Beautiful job. Total strikes. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Hospital swollen shot. Very swollen now. Time to fight down on the mouthpiece and move forward. Well, without much resistance, he continues to find a home for that jab, much like he did in the previous round. Try to establish that jab. Kick to the body by Us. Nicely done to the body. Oh, that's some wrestling right there. Tags him with the left, Joe. Moves to north-south. He's pounding him. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. Big body punch. And again, look at that, clinch. Usman gets the double underhooks. Well, that's how you draw it up. Nice trip to secure the takedown. Now he's in half guard. Excellent 
good posture here. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Gamebred. Oh, mount. Hip escape, gets out of the full mount. Ooh. Nasty elbow lands to the head. Right back in the full guard. Perfectly timed sweep. 60 seconds now to go in the fight. Hits the reversal here and in the full guard. And pummels under and out of double underhooks. Well, you don't want to spend too much time fighting off of your back, Joe, but pretty good work here from the bottom by Gamebred. Boy, Todd Plump. And it's a knee. With a big knee. Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. He's hurt. Uh, and that's uh, the end of round number two. Oh, and there's the horn. The round is over, and that came just at the right time. He got absolutely buckled by that body shot, and it came just before the end of the round. Saved by the bell, I wouldn't argue otherwise. Back to the stool he goes. We'll see if he can recover. And here we see a perfectly executed suplex. And here we see excellent timing with this trip. We really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. The beautiful Jenny Andrade to get us going. Ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. And now Masvidal's lower jaw now, Joe, starting to show some signs of swell. <laughs> Effective strike there by Kamala. Slightly deflected. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Game Fred gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Usman's kick to the body. That one blocked by the defense. Beautiful. Great exchanges. Oh, lands that punch. And there he swung with a haymaker. Masvidal gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Just misses without oh, one. Oh, man. This could be it right here. He's getting tagged. Spinning breakfast. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. He got tagged there. Good shots by the champion. Ooh! Masvidal, oh, he's yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Oh, he's hurt! Oh, oh he has to slam for him there. Wow! Oh, nice punch there by Us. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Big, Big body shot! shot. Body. Hip escape, nice hip escape. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Gamebrick. Beautiful elbow there. That was a hard elbow there by the champion. Nice shot to the head. And now Masvidal's face is a hot mess, man. That cut on his cheek is getting worse by the minute and worse with every strike landed by his opponent. There he goes, side control, nice. He lands a big shot from the bottom. Masvidal getting absolutely worked here from the top. Let's see if there's an uptick in his urgency here as he tries to get back up. Engaging in the clinch here, Joe. Masvidal's got double underhooks now. One overhook, one underhook. And they separate. Changes his stance. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh! Oh, very nice. What a round. 
stop, stop, stop. All right, the round is over. Gut check time for him now. You see the cut on his cheek has gotten really, really bad. And even though it's not affecting his vision, if it gets any worse, the doctor will be called in. And I can assure you, he's going to have no choice but to stop this fight. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. And here's another shot to the head that really stuns. Several near fight ending moments in that round. Lots of action. Good to have Brazil's Jenny Andrade in the building here. for five five-minute rounds. Whoa! This could be it. Body kick, look at that. Head kick! And now starting to snap off that jab. Oh, big left. Body kick is blocked. He just whips that punch in. Oh, he tagged him with the left. He's got him right here. Yet again, he goes back to the jab and he lands it. And defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. He continues to lean into his opponent's striking range. He's going to have to. Oh, he hurt him. He hurt him bad. Look at this. Take down. Back to the feet. All right, hook attack. Oh. No good. Oh. And another one. He's in trouble. Yeah, this ain't good for Masvidal. And now Masvidal's eye really starting to swell now. He hip escapes from the full mount. Now he gets the full mount again. Big punch from the bottom. Oh, look at that! That is it! Unbelievable! Kamaru Usman! Dropped him and then took care of business on the ground. Really excellent, excellent job. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound, and it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight, and that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next, and ultimately the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. Well, what a night for the UFC welterweight champion as he wins the belt with a knockout victory. He had some doubters coming in here tonight. Those people are pretty quiet right now. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at two minutes, 34 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout and still. So there he is, the man they are all still chasing at 170 pounds. The undisputed UFC welterweight champion remains as such and does so by way of the knockout here tonight. A great moment for the corner there as you see them start to celebrate.